How's it going everyone? It's Cody B Pyrotechnics and today we're going to be taking a look at another canister shell kit. This one by Raccoon Fireworks. It looks pretty standard because the name is just extra large 5 inch canister shell. In total I paid $59.99 plus tax for this kit and if we turn it around to the back you'll notice all the effects are listed right there. However they're not numbered so I'll be interested to see if the physical shells actually have numbers on them instead of just effects. But you can see some photos here. A couple of them look real, like for instance, this one, that one, this one, that one, and this one, and maybe that one. <laughs> but anyway, the rest of them are stock images. When you see them stretched like that, it means it was shot in time lapse. Consumer fireworks don't look like that. So let's get this opened up and take a look at the shells. Okay, so opening up the box, um, so for 12 shells anyway, $59.99 plus tax. It's not the greatest deal, but it's not the worst. I know I had a guy comment the other day on the channel that a 24 kit of cans in Ohio is going for $400. To a lot of you guys, that may seem unbelievable, but I can tell you from experience, I've seen 24 kits go for $230 at retail. So the $400 price tag isn't too far off. <laughs> I, you know, it's a ridiculous markup too. It's like 500% if you do the math on, you break down the case to the retail kits themselves. Let's get these shells out of here. Anyway, these are five inch. Um, oh, we really didn't look at the, the graphic on this, but I love it. It's got uh, some cool stuff going on here. Maybe that's from like a video game or a movie. I don't know if you guys let me know. But kind of a standard name, right? Five inch extra large cans. That's all they tell you. So they are labeled for effect, they're just not numbered. So this one here is Silver Palm with red and blue. Let's just see if we can find that on the back. Uh, right here, Silver Palm with red and blue. So they are labeled for effect correctly. So we don't really need to talk a whole lot about these shells. Um, let's look at the tube though. Oops, you're gonna get two of these tubes in the pack and they just look like that. Standard 12 inch. Wooden base here on the bottom, concrete plug down there. It's a little rough up here on the top, and you gotta be careful when you're fusing, because uh, that stuff will get in your fingers and you need duct tape to get it out. But anyway, we don't have to worry about that because we're gonna be fusing all 12 shells into a mortar rack that is currently over here drying. <laughs> get a shot of that for you. So unfortunately, this is what happens when you leave your racks in the back of the pickup. They fill up with snow or rain, and then you gotta drain them out and dry them with a fan before reloading the rack the bottom of that lift charge gets wet and it doesn't work. So that's what we're doing right now. When this is done drying, we'll get right back to you. So I figured while I'm waiting for that rack to dry, I might as well just put a number system on these things. So I actually ended up numbering them one through 12. So that way we can match up the effects with the order we're gonna be shooting them in. So you'll see I wrote one here on the shell all the way up to shell number 12, which would be the last effect here on the box. So this way we will kind of be able to match the effects with uh, what's going on here on the box and then what's happening up in the sky when we shoot them off. They'll be fused one through 12. All right, here goes the five inch extra large canister shells by Raccoon Fireworks. We've actually got Kate on the torch tonight. Here we go, just go ahead whenever you're ready. I gotta watch my step, because it's really dark out here. This is the whole rack. Yeehaw. Let's get this way a little bit. Oh, I hear the coyote. <laughs> Don't like that. Oh, nice. Oh, nice red lace. Wow. Whoa, <laughs> all the way to the ground. Yeah, me too. Whoa, <laughs> here we go. Oh, these are nice. These are real nice shells. 
Oh my God. Wow, look at that. Lots of lace effects. Wow, those were good shells, let me tell you. Uh, so what's interesting is it seemed like there was a generic wrap on the label and they're just called extra large five inch cans. The whole rack fired. Those shells, 10 out of 10, what did you think? Those are good. Did you hear the coyotes? I didn't hear them. I heard them. Yeah. They're coming for us. They are. How about the mountain lions? Scary. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you next time.